Hey Simmers, welcome to Make 2 and a live build of a two-story house. As of the time of this video, we are in week one of the Dream Homes update, so we've had the patio quest, but nothing else yet. And I just wanted to show off some of the new building techniques in the Dream Homes update. As usual, I'm going to go ahead and choose the exterior wall and roof that I want ahead of time so that I don't have to spend money changing these later. And if you've noticed the fence and sidewalk here, these are custom fence and sidewalk for the designer home and a few other pre-built houses in the game. Basically what I did was I bought the designer home and then demolish the house room by room so that I could start with an empty lot with this special fence. So what I've just built are the kitchen, entryway, and a combination living and dining area. And this is the hallway for the downstairs bedrooms. As you know, with the Dream Homes update, we now have the ability to build rooms that are as small as one by two blocks so that changes a lot of things. Here we've got the second floor for 300,000 smolians, and this is where the staircase is going to come out into the upstairs hallway. There are going to be two bedrooms on the lower floor and two on the upper floor. So now I'm going to build the master suite. And this one by two room is going to be a closet for the master bedroom. <laughs> and this is going to be a sort of playroom. I've left some blank space on the end there because I'm hoping that the balconies quest will allow me to build balconies there. So I'm building a patio here, but technically I consider this to be a porch. So what I'm going to do is build a railing around it and put in a gate. So that's the porch. Now I can put in doors through the property. This is actually a rebuild of a house that I already have in my town, Sims Landing. So I had this house for a while. I posted pictures of it to Tumblr and it got to be pretty popular. It's actually the most reblogged post I've ever made on my Sims Landing Tumblr. But when the update came out, I decided to remodel the house a little bit and see what new kinds of things I could do with the new building techniques. And so now I've decided to do a live build of it for you guys. So the cool thing about the update is that doorways and windows can now go up against another wall. You don't have to leave a blank block around a door or a window the way you used to. So that means you can make these cool sort of almost L-shaped rooms if you, you know, do a two block wide room like I've just done and then just put a double wide doorway in there. So windows are going in now. And by the way, you guys, if you're using this live build as inspiration for your own towns, obviously feel free to put in whatever items or decorations you want to, whatever you can afford, whatever you like. This is just demonstration for you. In fact, the fully decorated version that I have in my town which I'll be showing pictures of at the end of the video, is not exactly like this either. Like I've got different items and windows and doors and all of that throughout my version of the house. So again, I'll show pictures of that towards the end of the video. I'm really liking the fact that we can have windows side by side by side Definitely taking advantage of that with some other houses in my town. 
Actually, in my town, the sims that occupy this house are Game of Thrones characters. So I had a question in a comment about why I call my town Sims Landing, and it is because of the city King's Landing in Game of Thrones. And so in my town, this house has uh, Jon Snow, Arya Stark, Sansa Stark, and Daenerys Targaryen as the occupants. And then they have a husky dog, which is meant to be a dire wolf, and a dragon, which is meant to be one of Daenerys' dragons. <laughs> Okay, so now we can put in the staircase. And we're going to start putting floors throughout. and walls. This room in the middle here is going to be an office off of the large playroom. Again, you can see the fully decorated version in pictures towards the end of this video. That middle room is bathroom for the two bedrooms below. We can put in fixtures. I'm going for the free Philips Sonicare vanity because it's free. And this is the master bathroom. And now for the kitchen, I'm going to put in these elegant style countertops. going to leave space for an oven and I'm going to wrap the counters around because on the end here I like to have a, uh, a room for a breakfast, breakfast table, that kind of thing. Now I'm building a pool and I'm going to match the paving to the porch paving. I'm just putting in some gardening decorations. I 
And so this is the fully decorated version. You can see I put some park benches on the porch. And for the upstairs, I'm really looking forward to the balconies quest because I want houses with balconies. And this is the rooftop view so you can see the outside of the house. Now if you want to visit my house in my town, Sims Landing, then you need to become neighbors by making friends on Facebook. Information for that is in the video description below. No Game Center unfortunately because I've reached the 500 friend limit on Game Center. And I got a message on Facebook asking for a birthday shout out. so. Here you go, Angela. Happy birthday. Thanks for watching, guys.